Hey everybody, we're done crying. We're done crying and we're ready to go again. Yeah. yeah. Push through. We're going to push through, we're going to build more stuff, and we're going to survive. Yeah, we're going to do this. We're... With the exception of Marin, who might not survive. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> I feel bad now for putting him through all this shit. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> he oh fixed my... the guy's toy. That was cute. Okay. Maybe, we... yeah, that was him. Yeah, he we... fixed the it's, toy. It's giving so much flavor to... Look at his face. He looks so cute. Okay, let's... um. Let's do stuff. So where are we? We're oh, I'm drawing this event card because the top of the day. We need a firearm, man. We got this day and the next day to get a firearm. How do we get one? We can't make it. We have to find it, right? We got to find a broken one and put it together, or we can just try our they luck. They probably had one in that sniper area that went away. Visitors do come with firearms. I can guarantee got that. Got the visitor card. All right, let's see. Event. Shelling. Add one coal to the coal space. Oh, it's already gone to shit. <laughs> <laughs> we need to build a board up. <laughs> if more than one character went scavenging during the previous, previous night. night, which there wasn't, your shelter becomes the target of shelling. Thank God we only sent one person out. It's like we knew, but we didn't. Destroy, distribute two wounds between present characters and destroy already built fitting cards. That's brutal, man. Oh, I'm so happy we only sent one person. Yeah, that's rough. Jeez. Okay. Geez. Well, that was a close one. Because yeah, we only sent one person because of snipers. Yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine if we sent two people, they were both sniped, and then they got blown up with shells? <laughs> That'd be the end of our war. <laughs> of mine. <laughs> All right. It's your turn it's to so do actions. Happened. Well, we've only got two actions on two of our characters. One action on two of our characters. Yeah, so they'd only get to do the first action phase. And, and then, then Bruno can do all Bruno three. Bruno would do three action phases. Maybe Bruno should make a bed. Wait, how much uh, fatigue do they recover sleeping on two, the floor? Two. Okay, so, so that's not necessary. Yeah, that's not necessary. Yeah. So we want Bruno probably to go looking for vegetables. I would maybe just play the visitor card now, because the end of the at the end of the morning phase, I would play the visitor card. Oh yeah, at the end of any phase. Yeah. So do you think that's probably and that yeah. gives us more yeah, and, and, to react and maybe going. more characters to actually use. Yeah. Okay. No, that makes sense. At the end of the morning phase, uh, visitors will come and visit. Okay. We draw that's... two, and resolve them. So shall I draw one at a time and resolve them one at a time? Okay. Draw and resolve two cards. I think just draw two. Yeah. I think they just they just happen. There's no choice. Okay. So first card is. Arrival. A grim and silent stranger asks for shelter. If you decide to take this person in, draw from the unused characters deck and add them to your group. They start at level 3 misery, and they come with a hatchet and jewelry. Then remove this arrival card from the game. If you decide not to take them in, you may buy any items this person is carrying. The with the trade commission zero. zero. What's the other card? I think you can look at both, because it says draw and resolve two. Okay. Oh, an arrival with loads of food. But two wounds. And we just traded away our medicine. Mm. What's worse, misery three or two wounds? I think two wounds, because you got to bandage them. And he, this person won't be able to do as many actions. That's true, but then they come with all that food. But we can <laughs> trade for the food. Do we have anything to trade for that food? Commission three. We have food, we can trade for food. <laughs> with commission three yeah we can give up our electrical part and our food for food <laughs> well we were going to build the stove anyway to try and get more food yeah but that this this also means one more mouth to feed don't forget oh yeah so if we take this person in we'll have enough food for everybody yeah straight away but neither of these get us closer to any firearms decisions the grabbing a hatchet would be awesome just to have a weapon for the night phase plus uh, Marco can use it to go through our locked doors mm. not that we actually have that many well we got them on the top deck top top floor of the house but we would discard the hatchet if we got through would we? yeah it says Marco may use a hatchet to open locked doors as if he was using a lock pick uh, that's silly Oh no, because it says, yeah, it says discard the lockpick. Yeah, so I yeah. assume it's discard the hatchet. Yeah. Hmm, so we can't really even use it for that. It seems stupid. Why would you use a hatchet? Just use a lockpick. I'm guessing it means you can... Keep... I just feel like if we take this person in, we get 25 worth of stuff. And the other person, well, 22 worth of stuff. Damn, 
This is so difficult. This is so difficult. We've got two weapon parts. It's enough to make a hatchet if we build the metal. If we shop. took this person in, we could use the jewelry to buy some food. We'll commission three, though. Yeah, but that's okay. We just, what, well, we ditch like a... Don't really have anything we want to ditch. Sugar. We'd have to ditch the sugar. Yeah, we could ditch the sugar. That's fine. We don't need sugar. Yeah, we just ditch the sugar. Jewelry for food. Keep a hatchet, and then we've got someone that can do stuff. And then, which means we'll be able to probably build the uh, the stove this turn. All right, let's take this person then. Does that make sense? A grim and silent stranger asks for shelter, or a gravely wounded stranger asks. For... I feel bad. They're gravely wounded. <laughs> We're just gonna turn them away. It's 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 their liability. But do we want to take two vegetables or raw food? Probably. They're a liability. That's so rough. <laughs> now I feel bad. <laughs> so it's one thing playing this on your own and playing it on camera and actually going through like shit. <laughs> We've got to be tough. If you want to get to know someone, this is what you play with them. <laughs> okay. Um, Can you imagine playing this with the person who's just like super like harsh and hard? Yeah. It's like, I didn't know that about you, man. Okay. They're like, oh, screw those people. <laughs> Imagine yeah, playing this with an actual survivor. That would be like, that would be, oh yeah, that would be bad. Oh god, I wouldn't play this with a survivor. No, I would. I would absolutely no. I would play, you know, anything else. I wouldn't even play an Agricola with an actual survivor. <laughs> <laughs> I I think we should we should take we should take this person hundred percent. Yeah. Okay. Let's yeah. do it. Draw a character. We have Roman the deserter. Cool. So, okay. Cool. Well, he's red. That's good. That is good. So he starts with two misery. All right, so he can't... Ooh. So he smokes, and people... He doesn't like people who are wounded. If he's wounded or ill, he also is sad about that. So we really need to resolve his misery. How do we raise misery? Build a chair. All right, Roman. Don't worry, buddy. We've got your back. We're going to make you a chair. <laughs> well, welcome to dudes in a house. So get, and he comes with jewelry and a hatchet. So now we remove this from the game. Cool. Cool. Can we uh, like draw the next character card just to see who this was? Can no. We turn to, oh. so, so we're gonna trade this person. So you may trade, yeah. So we jewelry get jewelry and sugar for a, for a raw food. Yeah, right? that makes sense because then we can spend another. If we improve the thingy, yeah. Because then if we improve the stove, you following? Yeah, 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 yeah. We can make more food. We can turn it into a. We can turn we can turn two food into five to four food, yeah. Dinner provides an additional food. So we need a raw food, a water and a wood, and we can create three raw food. Yeah. Yeah. Someone's gonna be thirsty. But uh shit. <laughs> no, because we've got four water. Oh no, because we have to use a water for that. But if we take two vegetables, we don't even uh, we don't even have enough food. No, because then Mar uh, Bruno can uh, try and get another vegetable. Oh yeah, that's true. But if we use our raw food and just eat it straight away, we won't ever be able to cook a dinner, and that's how we're going to get more raw food and more raw food. See what I mean? Well, I don't understand. Is if you cook dinner, why do you get raw food? You should get cooked food. <laughs> it makes no sense. <laughs> I'm not wrong, <laughs> right? I mean, cooked cooked dinner is just two raw foods. Yeah, but you, I mean, I don't understand why dinner just makes raw food into more raw food. That doesn't make any sense. What do we chop up the wood in the water? Like, we just soak the wood and then grind it into a paste and mix that in with the raw meat. It's like, here's your, your beef and wood. I don't know, man. It's weird. So, what are we, what are we grabbing? A raw food or two vegetables? Or, you know, do we... If someone goes thirsty, what happens? Their misery goes up by one? It's a chance of misery or hunger. It's a chance of misery or hunger. I think we I think we take the gamble with the water because if we get too raw food... The thing is, we're going to have to poke about. It's crazy because we've got one person... Three, four people doing the first action, which would be like poke about... Yeah, Marin's going to have to poke idea. about. Idea. Yeah. 
um, and maybe two people on the dig through. Oh, and, and build a rainwater thing. Oh man, it's not going to work. We don't have enough shit. <laughs> we don't have enough components. Okay, so let's take the vegetables. And then uh, if we take the vegetables and find another vegetable, then at least we're sort of set for food. And then if we can make more food, great. And if we can't, so be it. And then remove that from the game. No, no, that's shuffled back into the visitor's deck. No, no, it says remove the survival from the game. Only if you take the person in. If not, it oh. shuffles back into the visitor's deck. Okay. So we've sent them back out wandering in the cold. To be honest, it's not much better in here anyway. <laughs> Okay, um, so that's that's that phase. So now you, we're starting off the action phase. Yeah, so starting off the action phase. Well, we know that Marin is going for a pokeabout. We know that uh, Bruno's going to try and use his special character ability to find a vegetable. The thing is, if we go for the heap... Why are we... Oh, you, do you think we'll have a better chance in, in instead of going for a pokeabout? Probably. Like, Marin Which, doesn't have to do this yet. Bruno. Yeah, well, Bruno. One person can go a bit hungry. Like Bruno could go a bit hungry. Oh no, he can't. No, uh, um, Marco could go a bit hungry. Is it possible to raise to zero? Yeah, you just remove the thing completely. That's cool. Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, this is a fucking nightmare floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think we're ever going to get up there. Um, and we need a saw blade. Where are we going to get a saw blade? To make one. Can we make a shovel? We can't make a shovel yet. Um... Okay, so instead of going poke about, what if we set these two to clear that rubble? Um, Let's make the rainwater collector. Somebody makes a rainwater collector. No, we got someone who can go scavenging now. Um, is there an upgraded version of this? Uh, there's an upgraded version of the work. Oh, wait, hang on. Let's have a look. No. So the rainwater collector goes somewhere. All by itself. Here. Oh, no. Uh, here. Yep, here. Uh, we can't build that yet because we don't have enough components. Ah, oh, fudge. Yep, we need more components in order to build that, so that's why they're doing that. But that's the thing. If Because think about it. For the first action, they do that. The second action, they do that. The third action, we'd only be able to build it. We won't be able to proc it. So someone would have to poke about. Okay, so uh, Marin back to the poke about. Uh, then it doesn't really matter whether we go through there now this round or not. But uh, even so, what is the the rainwater collector is five, so we really need him to roll well, or else we're done anyway. Yeah, it, he does it twice. But yeah, we yeah we're right. Um, in the meantime, can um, I see the improved things quickly? Yeah, yeah. Or we can we can risk uh, going out and getting another visitor. But we don't really have anything useful. Oh, yeah, we'd just be trading. Yeah, we'd just be true. trading and possibly not making a profit. Mm. Um, well, improving the stove would be great. Yep, two mechanical parts. I mean, Oh, the chair. That's what we want to get. Yeah, the chair. One component, two wood. After crafting the chair, lower all characters' misery by one. Which would help almost everybody. Yep, I agree. I think uh, building a chair would be so great. someone needs to go make an idea. Okay. Well, uh, Marin, you've only got... Marin's doing that. Um, so why don't we send uh, Marco to go and have an idea? And uh, he can choose two ideas. Yeah, so that's good. Think of two. Oh, we can improve the moon. Killers, isn't We're it? getting the cooking stove in the chair, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just looking what else there is. Um, the, um, the deal... But we can't make the cooking stove if we're making the water thing. So we don't have enough mechanical parts. Yeah, yeah. Um, Where's the water thing? Uh, just have that out, just so we can... Here, rainwater collector. Grab it, grab it. I left it on top. So we have an idea. Okay, okay so, uh, yeah, because it requires a mechanical part. But we can still pick up the thing now that's useful. Yeah. Um. So, someone else could go have a poke about. Uh, oh, or yeah, any we... number of characters can be here. Yep. Um. Or we can set these two up to the rubble to clear it and try and get to the heap. That would be good, because we could build the, the chair on the third action. You know yeah, I mean. uh, well, I mean, maybe. Maybe, depending on how well this rolls. Yeah. I think that's a good idea. Okay. Because the thing is, after this, only Roman and Bruno will have actions left. Yeah, so they'd probably be able to build, like, the rainwater collector and maybe go there. If we're lucky, and then the last person can build the chair. That means we get the misery down and we've got a rainwater collector. 
Oh, we need the rainwater collector procced. We also have the crude stove uh, to proc, ideally. I mean, we can let someone go hungry. The Roman can afford to go hungry, can't he? Yeah, yeah, he can. What's Marco's deal? It's if someone gets to hunger three that he gets sad? Yeah. Okay. So Maron's eating. <laughs> yeah. Okay, cool. This is for Marin. He adds three to this roll, so I really need a six up. Okay, do it. I might use the blue one. <laughs> Show me good luck, blue one. You're my color. Can't change dice. Huh? Can't change dice. I don't change dice. <laughs> one. You got a component. Good job. Uh, no, I had three, so it's four, so that's the worst possible thing. I don't think we're building the uh, rainwater collector this round. That's fine. At least everyone's drinking. Um, and maybe if someone... I mean, Roman can go out scavenging. So we pick these two things. Yeah, Roman can go scavenge. It's fine. He's got a shitty inventory, but he can do it. Yeah. Um, they dig through here. Yep. Yeah. Okay, now uh, Marin and Marco can't actually take any more actions. Okay. So, one of them could go here. Yep, I think that's a good idea. Um, one of them could make a board up. I think making a board up's a good idea. We've got too cold. Uh, we can't make a board up because we don't have the right... Uh... Oh, yeah, we can. One component and four wood. And then someone can build the chair. Um, and hopefully that heap will have some... Uh... Some extra bits. We could also make the improved cooking stove. No, we can't. We have enough components. Uh, we could do this, yeah. To make the board up. One component and four wood. Oh, we need to take one. Yeah, that'll go here. Mm -hmm. Cool. All right, cool. All right, so that this was me. Yep. And then it's going to be you next. Okay. Yep. And uh, I'm going to get to play with this guy. Oh, three components, electrical part, and a water. We also get a board up. You can put it here or here. I'll put it here. Cool. And you put three components in the water? Three water? Three. Oh. One water and, well, just two more components. Sweet. Okay. Uh, and then... For his last action, I think he should probably make the water thing or the improved stove, right? No, the chair. He's going to build a chair. He should probably build a chair. Yeah, because he's one away from epilogue. Yeah. <laughs> one away from misery epilogue. We've just got this cool red character. Yeah, I that's, true. that's see... true. Yeah, I think build the chair. Build the chair. Where are we going to put the chair? Um, oh, shit. I don't really have room. Mm. Cut through the bars. Yeah, we need a saw blade. Oh, did you know that there's a ladder going down to here? Oh, I didn't know that. So yeah, the saw blades are for this furniture. We need to make a shovel. Yeah, that would be sweet. We can go down here and get this furniture too. I didn't even know there's a ladder there. Good spot. Well done. Well, I mean, uh, we could put it here, yeah, but we have to put it there. Um, I just thought that's where the rainwater would go. Yeah, I was hoping that too. But it's cool, the rainwater could go here as well we could just use this for three things and this for just improved things and then her try and get through there yeah okay cool so building a chair building a chair cost a component and two wood for each book from story in the storage add two to the roll oh now we have a use of books we can read books on the chair damn it so everyone's misery is increased boom you mean decreased decreased yeah so he gets the two cool Sweet. I think that was a good a good shout, to be honest. Cool. Did we discard the components? Yep, I did that. Cool. All right. So now these are just put back in our ideas pile. Then we're done. Yeah, our fittings pile. Fittings pile. So that was your action. Now it's back to me. Mm -hmm. So we do the dusk. Everyone must drink a water. Discard. Yeah, we do manage. We do have five water, so that's okay. That's good. He could have cooked. I just realized he could have cooked. Why? Because then, yeah, well, anyway. 
Okay. Um, now. Um, yeah, I mean, he could have. Uh, he could have gone and found vegetables, but each character should eat one. But everyone who doesn't eat raises hunger by one. Vegetable, you keep your hunger the same. Raw food, you go up one. Yeah, that's absolutely fair. So same, same, up one. Guess who's hungry? Sorry, Roman, but uh, you know, we made you this nice chair. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair. Okay. Now we need food again. Oh my god, it's like we always need food. What is going on? <laughs> cool. So now, uh, next player continues to the evening phase. So now it's you. Now we assign to People's sleep places. on the floor, guard duty, or scavenging. Who's, that's Marco. During combat, Roman always rolls the yellow combat die unless he has a better weapon. Wow. <laughs> That's really good. <laughs> well, Roman's going scavenging. Yeah? Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, the only thing is, if Roman gets shot by that sniper, that's basically end of days. He gets three rerolls. That's true. Okay. Um, he doesn't. He has a crap inventory, but so be it. That's, we just need to bring back a, like two raw food. That's it. <laughs> Um, so I'm because they had two fat fatigued, they're now no longer fatigued. Yay, that's, that's they're looking okay. Well, our guys are looking good. So, Marin is about to be shot. Uh, well, hang on, when do I sign weapons? Um, not yet, after we roll for scaring. So, uh, oh, wait, shit, no, <laughs> you forget, I forgot to do this because <laughs> they're actually doing stuff. God damn it, <laughs> I just want everyone like available. Why can't you just all be happy? <laughs> Like the <laughs> we made you a chair. <laughs> okay, it's me to do scavenging. Let me roll to hit, to hit him. Here, you can have your favorite die. Give me the red die. I need the red die. Oh, it's the red die. Red combat die. Yeah. So, I mean, you got three rerolls to make this good. What does that symbol mean? A uh, shotgun. It's only if you're using a shotgun. Okay. So I got a... Sniper is not using a shotgun. I got a 50-50 chance of nothing bad. Okay. And three rerolls. Cool. Seems seems plausible. Uh-oh. You zigged when you should have zagged. I think I'm going to re-roll that. Okay. Okay, I'm going to re-roll that. Uh-oh. <laughs> I got one more re-roll, don't I? Have you used two? Yeah. What's that? Is that only shotgun? That's shotgun, yeah. Odds are I sh <laughs> It's your call, then. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> when do they die? Four wounds? Yeah. But three wounds, they can't do anything. No. I mean, you rolled a two, right? So it would take two wounds. Yeah. We should put him down to one action. Yeah. And he'd get miserable again because he hates taking wounds. Risk it. Risk it. Do you want yes or no? If it was X-Wing and I was rolling to hit, I would risk it. Okay. Because that's a 50-50 on those dice. Huh. It's two again. Okay. I mean, we didn't lose anything. No, no, we didn't. It, it was just fate. Yeah, I mean, you rolled that result three times. Yeah, that's true. All right, he's wound. taken two wounds, but the good news is the snipers are no longer here. Which is great. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> so now great. we need some not more things than just food. We need some freaking bandages as well. Okay. Yep, yeah, and... Uh, Choose one of the available locations. He's going to start being miserable again. Oh, we can also... Oh, we choose equipment after we choose where we're going. So... I mean, there's a chance of finding bandages at the school, but we'll get the fewest explorer cards, and it's really unlikely. Rubble and jam door and stuff. Oh, yeah. Open space. Uh, you could go trading again. What was it? It was three but condition. we don't have anything to trade. To trade the hatchet. But we kind of want it for the guard, don't we? 
Yeah, we won the hatch on the god for sure. Wait, but because we can bring back a knife. When can we bring back a knife? Uh, during the scavenging phase. Yeah, but we resolve... have to resolve the guard stuff before we get the findings, right? No, no. This is when we when we resolve one of these cards. So we could go yeah, scavenging. But we find a knife and put it in the findings pile. We don't get yeah. a knife. Yes, but we put it there and we could trade the knife. Oh yeah, because we've got a hatchet now. Yeah, it's worth eight. Food is ten. Bandages are ten. Fuck off. Commission. So we need a five to go with that. This game. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, in a in a heap though, in the findings, we would probably get like. Some stuff? Yeah, like at least Maybe we five. should just go to Central Square because it's going to give us the most cards to find stuff with. And then it's six to trade anyway. Well, it's six to trade at Old Town as well. Yeah. And we just have fewer cards there. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense. Socialize with people. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You want me to pay to socialize with people? <laughs> Are you mad, bro? We don't have time to socialize. We're wounded and looking for aid. Although it might up his misery. I mean, reduce his misery. Oh, Can you imagine? He's fucking bleeding everywhere now. I mean, at least, like, well, what a trooper. He took a sniper hit and now he's going exploring. <laughs> oh, wow. I mean, I'm sure it doesn't stop them from scavenging. I mean, I wouldn't put it past it. To be like, if you take a sniper bullet, go home. <laughs> do we want to take the uh, the hatchet or the or the knife? Oh, we're gonna do that later, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. One, um, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. These electrical 10, parts, 10, what are they 10, good for? Lots of crafting. Okay, let's keep them. Like, yeah, like, have a look. Like, the, I mean, is there anything we need to build immediately? That, that's well, it doesn't. I'm thinking it's got a weight on it anyway, and Roman's inventory is only three. That's true. I'd rather he saves the inventory space to bring stuff back. Yeah, but that's fine. You can send him out with as much as you want. It's, I think it's... No, but he's... Not oh, yeah, it's up to your... Yeah, so when he comes back, we have to discard stay. down to his inventory yeah, size. Yeah. You have like... A, so electrical if, parts is needed by mainly upgrades. Well, we should keep them anyway. I don't... Because I just think it's going to reduce his inventory size. Gee, so pass me the... Pass me the... Have to, the, so the idea. The idea. Yeah. Well, yeah. actually needs to electrical components. The efficient heater... The improved moonshine, the vegetable garden, which we kind of need actually, because we're gonna have to make herbs soon. Shit, we need a fucking firearm, man. We need a firearm. Yeah. We have this turn and next turn to find a firearm. If we don't get one, what happens? It says here. Distribute three wounds. I mean, that's yeah. not the worst thing, but it's still pretty bad. Wounds, are, wounds suck because then we need suck. more bandages. But if we do it. We we don't draw a night raid card. It's okay. I mean, I almost kind of want to keep the gun and have the beatings. <laughs> <laughs> but you need bullets to fire in the gun. We don't have any bullets. Yeah, you need, you need to make... We don't have any bullets. We need we ammo. Good lord. Ammo's only worth three? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's, let's do it. Okay, we're doing it. We're doing it. So uh, this is back to one. And let's go. Yeah. Tomorrow, to tomorrow. Play. It's always at this point. <laughs> it's almost it's consistent. Always, yeah. I think this episode ran a bit long, actually, but again, I'm it's not fine. sure because I keep losing track. <laughs> I just get wrapped up in this war of mine and then I forget <laughs> about the time. So uh, we'll be back tomorrow to find out if Roman can soldier on through his bullet wound and find a gun or something useful in the central square. Cool. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.